My name is Dennis Enix, and I'm the development director for the YMCA of Greater Louisville, uh, but I served as the executive director here of YMCA Safe Place Services from 1998 to 2008. And um, it was actually against the law for a young person to run away from home, and it was also against the law to harbor a runaway. And we really changed the community's perspective of you know that these kids were in you know serious crisis and we were funded as one of the first runaway homeless youth shelters in the country and the kentucky colonels has been a very um, generous supporter of safe place for many years they've provided our security camera system they've helped us with numbers of capital projects but this year with the covid um, request uh, we uh, applied to have all of our furniture recovered, to get some mattress covers, and to order some new furniture. Um, the furniture that we had in our shelter program uh, is over 20 years old. Uh, we've just had, we've been using it over and over and over again, and so this grant is going to help uh, really spruce up the shelter for the for the kids. So, so you can see that furniture is in various forms. Uh, it's not uniform. If, if a, a cover gets ripped, we ended up, you know, reusing old covers. And what we're going to be doing is making sure that all of those look the same. The other thing that we're doing is we're going to be doing mattress covers for the beds. You've got to see, we got a, a donation of Tempur-Pedic mattresses, but what will happen is they'll get torn and uh, we're going to get a... Um, a platform that's going to help um, uh, the life of the mattress covers. We have a number of fitness facilities and uh, programs and child care that help fund our mission and 25% of Safe Place's budget is funded by the YMCA and with COVID all of those activities cease to exist. And it's going to be years before we're able to build back to the strength to allow us to provide that internal generosity that's doing so much good here in the community. So we thank Kentucky Colonels for their gift and uh, we'll continue to kind of share with them our need over the years.